What's up, everybody? Welcome to episode number 40. At the end of the last video, I mentioned I was going to be doing some thieving first to get some runes before I started doing Slayer. I'm actually going to wait because I do really want to start doing Slayer. I'm going to wait until I have a task where I need to use Ancients with to actually go and do that. My current task is Greater Demons, so I really don't need Ancients for that. So let's go ahead and teleport here. Also, what I decided to do is at the start of all these videos, I think since I'm just going to be doing Slayer, I kind of want to show you guys how, how much XP I've gotten in Strength and Slayer. So I'm going to set up separate counters up here and reset them at the start of every video. As you see, this one's at zero. So at the end of every video, you guys will see how much strength XP and how much Slayer XP I gained during that video. So let's go ahead and use this sexy Corinne portal. So I'll be doing updates probably every single strength level, um, every HP level, and every Slayer level. So I'll either see you guys back once I get a level or once I have to actually go and get runes because I have a uh, task I need Ancients for. So I finished my Greater Demon task. I'm actually going to unlock superiors right now before the Slayer Helmet. The reason being, these give so much more Slayer XP that I'm missing out on, so there is superiors bought. Obviously, I have to be more careful now when these things spawn because some of them are pretty dangerous and can actually combo you out, so let's go ahead and get another task here. 19 Black Dragons, that's actually fucking AIDS. Actually, never mind, that's not that bad. I forgot there's baby Black Dragons now, so should be a pretty quick task. I'll see you guys back in a second. All right, give me a good task, please. Ooh, that's a fucking good task, boys. I think I've seen people actually using Ancients on these, but I'm just going to kill them with melee since it's fast as hell anyway, and it's not really needed. So here comes the first level of the video being 75 hit points. This task is actually very, very, very good for GP. Uh, these ones in the catacombs actually drop a lot of alkables, so I actually already almost have 100k. I should have maybe like 85k when I alk these two. But by the end of this task, I might actually have around 300k. I still haven't gotten a superior yet. I'll obviously show you guys that when I get my first one. I'll probably show you guys all the superiors I get just because of the chance of getting a drop. Uh, as you guys can see on the top counter, I'm close to a strength level as well, so that shouldn't be too far off. Should get 77 strength on this next hit coming up. Hopefully this gets us to 93 combat as well. Let's check this real quick. So still 92 combat. Uh, cash stack, 85k. Um, it's probably been about 4 minutes since I got the HP level, so it hasn't been too long. Uh, I do have a bunch of insult blood veiled heads. I think I got 2 or 3 uh, demon heads as well for my last task. So we should actually be able to get to 60 prayer today. If we do, I'm going to go and do the knight's training ground, and then we can start using chivalry. So um, I'll be back if I get a superior. I don't think I'll be getting another level from this task. I have about 100 kills left, so... Finished the blood veil task. Sadly, I did not get any superiors. One task away from getting some more points, though. Also, almost got around 500 blood runes, so that's going to be nice for uh, using Ancients later. And almost 200k, so let's get another task here. 83 Anku, pretty easy, quick task. So this is the next task after the Anku task. Uh, this is a pretty good task. <laughs> I love getting these herbs. Uh, there's 69 Slayer, getting close to doing Gargoyles and next, which should get me a lot of GP since they drop so much now. Um, I haven't had really any tasks to use Barrage on. I think the only ones are actually Dust Devils. Um, another one is Smoke Devils, but that's not till high 90s and maybe next. I want to do next in Eve's Cave because I want to get as many seeds as I can. So I might have to actually go back to doing Agility and Alking to get this initial magic level, but we'll see how it goes. So since I unlocked the superiors, I still haven't gotten any from any of the tasks I've done yet. I think I've done a full Blood Veil task and a full Abbey Spec task. Um, I think all the other ones don't have superiors. But here's another strength level. This should get me to 93 combat, but I'm actually one tick flicking right now. So I don't really want to check because I'll probably take a lot of damage. I don't think I'm anywhere close to another level, so it should be a little bit before I get the next one. Hopefully the next update is a superior because I still want to get one. So here is another strength level. There is 79, so I'm actually going to get two more of this task as well, as you guys can watch me miss these prey flicks because I can't do this shit while I'm talking. But I'm pretty close to a 16k away from 76 HP as well, and for Slayer, we are 18k away. So I was doing the math on how close I was to actually getting to 60 prayer, so I'm going to do the Knight's Training Ground and unlock Chivalry. And I need to get six Ensouled Heads from this task. I already have two, so we need four more and 141 kills. If I can manage that, I'll be able to actually go and get Chivalry this video. If not, I'll have to get it in the next one. So hopefully that happens. I'll see you guys back once I manage to get to 76 hit points. So about to get the HP level I was talking about getting before. There is 76. I have around 70 kills left in this task, and I only have three heads. So I have to somehow pull out three heads in that amount of kills so I can get to 60 this video. 60 prayer, that is. Um, I still haven't gotten a superior. It's kind of annoying. I've done this task 
This is going to be the second time I've done an Abbey spec task as well, and I think I've done one other task that gives superiors. So I guess I'm just really unlucky right now. Obviously, it's RNG based, so um, I sh still should get a Slayer level this task 6k away from 70. And there is 70 Slayer. Sadly, we only have four heads right now, and I only have about 30 kills left. So unless I get really lucky, it doesn't look like it's going to be happening. Um, I'm not going to get any more levels. Obviously, I'm pretty far away in all of these now since I got all of the levels this task. So good news, guys. I did finish the task, and I managed to snipe two more Blood Belt heads, so I have enough to get to 60 prayer now. So we can go ahead and do Knight's Training Ground after I get this new assignment. Let's see what it is. We are definitely fucking canceling that one. 162 trolls, not too bad, I'll take that. So last and sold head left until we get 60 prayer and then we can go unlock chivalry. I got pretty lucky on these head drops. I can't believe I actually managed to get those last two on that task. So I'll see you guys over at the Knight's Training Ground. I got my other Iron Man confused with this account and for some reason I thought I did the King's Ransom quest on this account. But apparently I haven't done it, so fuck man. So I need to go do that quest now. This video will probably be out a little later today, but I do still want to upload it. This quest takes maybe 20 minutes, so I'll go do that really quick and then head back over here. I rushed this quest so fast. I think I finished it in like 13 minutes or something. So now we can go do the training ground. Actually, 33k defense XP as well. Man, I thought I did this earlier. It would have been so nice for early defense XP, man. Damn it. I also got a 5,000 lamp reward. I'm just going to go ahead and use that on Herb, I guess. So pretty close to a Herb level now as well. All right, so back to where we were at before. So I'm not going to be taking anything other than a D skim. I know you can bring weapons for like stab, crush, slash, and stuff like that. I'm just taking this. I'm also taking a bunch of potatoes with cheese. I'm basically just going to be flinching this, so it shouldn't be too hard. Also, this is a safe death as well, so I didn't bring a teleport. Probably should have pre-potted, but I guess it's whatever. I'm probably not going to try to do flinching until I think the third guy is when it starts getting pretty hard. Fucking day 60 of flinching over here. This is taking so long. This guy is like an absolute tank. I should still be able to get through this. I think there's only one more guy left after this one, but it's still going pretty slow. So it looks like we're going to have to do this one with one food. I hope I get this guy in the safe spot really quick. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Please, please, please. One step. Okay, so we basically have to kill this guy without any food. And the flinch doesn't always work, so hopefully I can get through this. So it looks like he's about one hit away, so I should be able to get this pretty easily right here. Oh my fucking god, this guy's scary when he hits you because he lowers your stats by so damn much. Please die on this hit. Please, please, please. Oh my god, this is so AIDS. Yes, let's fucking go, boys. So there is Chivalry unlocked. Those nice XP drops as well. I'm actually 23k away from a defense level as well, so I'll probably go do that as my next level, but we fucking did it, boys. There it is. No more of this bullshit with ultimate strength and credible reflexes. So that's going to do it for this video. I hope you guys did enjoy it. We actually got a lot of stuff done on this one. Um, sadly, it's going to be uploaded pretty late from what you guys are used to because I had to go and do that damn quest. But thank you guys for watching. I'll try to have a video up tomorrow. I might have to skip a day, but I hope you guys enjoy this nonetheless, and I will see you in that next video.